Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today I'm going to go ahead and do a haul video. I've already filmed a video creating this look and I love it so much. I'm so inspired by it. I wanted to film another video today with this look. So if you guys are interested in the haul, stick around because I'm about to get into it. But before I do, if you haven't already, please like and subscribe because it really does help me out a lot and it is always greatly appreciated. And with that being said, let's get into today's video. So guys, I... Went and ran some errands. Uh, if you didn't see my JD Glow video, please check it out. I'm pretty sure it's most likely I'm going to go ahead and post it before I post this one. So you'll get a chance to see the look and how I created it. But I really love it and I was just feeling so inspired. I thought, well, I got to do some shopping and all that jazz. So I went and I ran my errands and I just want to show you guys what I got because it gives me an opportunity to film this look. <laughs> I don't know. I just really like it. It's making me happy. And it's good to be feeling good. So let's get into the haul. First thing I got, well, I went by Target because I wanted to grab a couple of things from there. And the one thing that I ended up getting was bananas. <laughs> Nobody cares about this. I was going there to get uh, body lotion and all that other stuff, but um, also with the bananas, but I didn't because there's an Ulta right by there. So I thought, why not go ahead and do an Ulta haul because it's right there and there's some things I need to pick up anyway that they don't have at Target. So just got the bananas from Target, even though I love Target, and headed on over to Ulta and grab some stuff to share with you guys. Now, the first thing I want to hop into are these shampoo and conditioners from Biolage. Is that the correct way to say it? I love this brand. I think that it's amazing. It's uh, incredibly nourishing to my hair. I've got the smoothing one for the shampoo and I've got, no, I'm sorry, I got the smoothing one for the conditioner and the hydro source for uh, the shampoo. And it's just a really good brand. If you have dry, porous hair like me, this is something that it's worth investing in it. Normally it's kind of on the pricey side, but it was 30 bucks for both of them. I thought I'm gonna get that because I'm running low on my shampoo and conditioner. I don't know where the hell to put it, probably over here. And I needed it anyway, so I went ahead and grabbed that. And it was so weird. I, I was wandering around Ulta for the longest time. I, I don't know why I felt so discombobulated because, I don't know, maybe I was really excited about my eyeshadow look. I have no idea what it was, but I spent so much time just looking around for stuff going, where is this? Where is that? And I just felt completely lost the entire time. So it took me a while to find what I was looking for, but I'm just rambling. I found some really good stuff. Now this next thing that I got, this is for my husband. He loves using this. This is his favorite uh, sculpting gel. I noticed that he was out of this the other day, so I went ahead and I picked that up for him. And if you guys are interested in prices and all that stuff, I'm gonna leave it down below for you. Another thing I wanted to get that I wasn't able to find on my last trip out was the squalene from The Ordinary. This is so great at balancing the hydration in my skin. I love this stuff. I have bought it several times over and I will continue to do so because it's freaking amazing. So I had to go ahead and get this. Next thing I got was this little um, wrinkle cream from Shiseido. I want to go ahead and give this a try. It was like 20 something bucks. I've been using this uh, peptide cream from Inky List, which is fantastic, but I'm running out and they don't carry Inky List. So I, I want to go ahead and repurchase that peptide cream because I thought it was really great and it's incredibly affordable. But I thought, meanwhile, since I'm here, you know, and wandering around like a crazy person, I'm just going to grab this because I want to have something to use in the meantime. And I didn't want to drive all the way to Sephora. I wanted to come home and film and do that whole deal before Pat comes home so that I can just focus on this and then get on with the rest of my day. So I was like, this is perfect. We're going to give it a try, see if we like it. I'll let you guys know what I think. But I really do like this product and I, I have a feeling I'm going to love it. But regardless, I'll, I'll let you know in the future. We'll see how it goes. I have good feelings about it though because it's a pretty decent uh, skincare line. The next thing I got, and I'm really excited to share this with you guys, is um, the Fenty Ease Drops because I am almost done with the one that I purchased. I feel like I wear this so often that I am just, I'm burning through it. I have several other foundations here that have more than enough left in them. I, I don't use them on the regular, but I am reaching for this a lot because I feel like for my mature skin, you know, just where I'm at in life, I feel like this is incredibly complimentary. I just really enjoy this and I, I repurchased it today. I'm wearing it today and I, I just feel like it looks really nice on me. So I went ahead and repurchased that and I'm gonna, maybe I'll do an empties video. I've never done one of those before. I usually just throw things out. I don't know. I don't really think about it at the time and it just kind of goes and I just go, oh, I could have done an empties video. Maybe I'll do one. Who knows? And that will definitely be in it because I am almost done with that. 
kind of crazy, kind of cool. The next thing that, <laughs> I know I'm rambling, but um, I'm happy, I'm in a good mood, which is wonderful. I'm just very grateful. So I continued to wander around Ulta because I wanted to find a nice body lotion and they have a really decent selection there, but I just, I couldn't seem to, you know, land on what I really wanted. And I even thought for a second I might get the Tan Lux Gradual Tanning Solution Lotion, but I don't know, if I, I thought, Ugh, what if you have to like make sure you're all scrubbed up and you know, because it can be streaky and you gotta be careful with that kind of thing. And I didn't want to turn orange. And I just wanted something that was a nourishing, decent lotion. And I was really just having a hard time finding anything. And I thought about getting like the Ulta vanilla scented. They have some pretty decent lotions, but sometimes they're a little overly scented and I didn't want to go that route. So I ended up landing on this from Drunk Elephant. I love this brand. I do believe that they are owned by Shiseido now. I'm not 100% sure, but I've never tried this before and they had a little um, tester there, so I, I gave it a little try. It was very soothing. My hands still feel very soft and I've washed them uh, already since I tried the lotion, so it seems like it's gonna be pretty decent. Now this is $20 before tax which is kind of pricey for a lotion, I'll admit, but when I get my Bum Bum Cream that I really love, if I want to do a splurge for a luxurious lotion, that's like 40 bucks, maybe more, I think. So this is actually a bargain compared to that, and I feel like it's gonna be, I don't know, pretty decent. I'm excited to try it. So I got that, and um, yeah, that's about it. <laughs> know it's just like a quick little haul and I will check back with you guys on this one let you know how I feel about it I have a good feeling though I, I think I'm really gonna like it um it, it is a little on the whatever side I was just gonna get like uh, my usual Palmer's cocoa butter kind of thing but I, I wanted to do a haul so I didn't you know what? <laughs> I was there and I wanted to give this a try, so I don't know, man. Yeah, that's my little haul. It's not all ginormous or anything like that. I didn't get any makeup or anything like that. I did look and they had some really cool stuff there. They had the um, the Star Wars little uh, eyeshadow palette from ColourPop. And oh my God, ColourPop is just churning it out. It's crazy, but I didn't want to do the makeup thing today. I wanted to go ahead and grab a couple things, except for this, obviously. my It's a little skin tint, but just some things that I really needed and, you know, stock up on and all that stuff. And I figured since I was loving this look so much, it gave me a reason to go shop at Ulta. So, <laughs> so here we are. That's going to do it for me today, guys. Thank you so much for sticking around and watching. I really do appreciate it. I hope you guys are having an amazing day and I will catch you all in the next one. Bye.